Joining us today is Adam Rosante, who creates easy to implement workouts to help you lose weight and tone up. And I have one goal for you. That's to help you live a strong, balanced, healthy life without losing any of the fun or style along the way. And that is exactly what today's workout is gonna do. I'm ready to get started. Let's do it. All right. All right, I hope you're ready to get it at home. Anna and Johnny, we're gonna tear it to pieces. We're gonna be working so hard, we are gonna peel the roof off of this studio. This is a very simple workout. I say simple, but not easy. It's six moves, and here's the key. All body weight. We have bulletproofed this workout for you to take away all excuses. How many times have you heard, no, I'm traveling, I can't work out. Too many. Oh no, I don't have access to a gym, exactly. I can't work out. Bull. This is all <laughs> body weight. You're gonna use the body you have to create the body you want. But before we get into the actual workout, okay. we're gonna start off with a dynamic warm up. Very, very important. It just lubricates your joints, gets the blood flowing, creates a little elasticity Love in the it. muscles. Love Best it. way to get ready for a hard workout. So let's come to stand with our feet hip width apart, chest open, shoulders down the back. Now I want you to imagine that you have a fishing hook on the inside of your belly button. Now pull your abs in and up, squeeze them nice and tight. You feel that? That's how I want you to keep your abs for this entire workout. Gonna give you a sneaky little ab workout, but also really protect your back. So we're gonna start off with some nice, gentle forward shoulder rolls. Nice deep breaths. I love it, I get everybody all amped up. I'm like, shoulder <laughs> rolls. We can do this. <laughs> nice forward shoulder rolls. Just starting to lubricate those shoulder joints. And we're three, two, one, go ahead and reverse it, drawing the shoulders up and back in space. Quick question for you, where are your abs? Did you forget about them already? Yeah, they they so <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> like, oh, totally, abs are totally tight. I've totally forgotten about them. Keep them tight. That's it, and we're three, two, one. Now go ahead and windmill the arms forward while marching in place. Beautiful, nice, big forward windmills really working through that full range of motion in the shoulder joint. And I want you to use your abs to lift and lower your, your legs, right? I don't want you to just hike them up. Really use the core to get it going. Now we're gonna reverse it, drawing the knee up and back in space, right? Ooh, That's it, beautiful. Like a, like a Yeah, here. exactly. I want you to imagine that it's like a, you know, you're pivoting back in space, really opening up that hip. Three, two, one. Now step the feet hip width apart. Reach the fingertips forward, draw the shoulders down and back, and we're gonna open and close the door. Really feel that nice stretch in the chest, back of the shoulder. The key here is you wanna keep the arms parallel to the floor. A lot of times I see people doing this kind of thing, right? Taking the arms down like a crashing plane. Uh -uh. Right in line with the shoulder. That's it. Beautiful, really open it up. Nice deep breaths, keep that core nice and tight. Abs are still in. Abs are still in, that's oh, yeah. it, that a girl, I love it. Where are your abs at at home? Nice and tight? If I could reach through the screen and pop you right in the belly, I should break my fist. There we go, and we're three, two, one. Now pay attention here, we're gonna reach wide, step wide. This takes a little bit of coordination. We're gonna twist to the left, and then touch down to the outside of the right foot. Back to center, and reverse that. Twist right, touch down to the outside of the left foot. Center and keep alternating. Twist left, touch down right, center, twist right, touch down left. And just stay with it, really opening up that lower back. When you come down, I really want you to carve out those obliques. And think about hinging back at the hips. So really pop that booty back like you're trying to close a door behind you. Push the hips back, come down. Oh, I love that stretch. Feels good, right? Feels I good want you to imagine that you're trying to saw off your pinky toe with your pinky finger on the way down. And take it down, center, step the hips, step the feet hip width apart. And from here, you're gonna windmill the arms forward, step forward with the right foot, drop it down into a low lunge. And I want you to imagine that you're sort of presenting someone a present. Nice proud chest, reach up tall through the crown of the head, then take the fingertips behind the head and turn it over that right thigh, really turning through the upper back. Step back to center, exploding off that right foot, and repeat on the opposite side. Windmill it forward, present that present, nice proud chest, fingertips behind the head, twist it over, explode back to center. Keep alternating. Gonna do just a couple of these on each side. Back to center, 
Really drop it down nice and low. Try to get that back knee as close to the floor as you can. Keep that front knee directly over the ankle. Really protect that knee joint. Beautiful. Take it center, feet hip width apart. Soften the knees, inhale, take it up. Exhale, dive down through the center of the chest, soften at the knees, walk the hands out to the top of the push-up position, wrist directly under the shoulders. Now lower the chest to the floor, two full push-ups. One, two. And if you have a problem doing push-ups, full range, and when I say full range, I mean chest to the floor, yeah. as if your chest has a date <laughs> with this floor. Woo. They're gonna be making out, chest to floor. You can't do that, lower the knees to the ground. Okay, now you're gonna walk the hands back toward the feet, soften the feet, roll up, inhale, take it down one more time. This time, plant the hands on the floor under the shoulders, baby step the feet back to the top of the push up position. Two push ups, baby feet back up under the hips, soften the knees, roll up, pressing into the heels, take it to the sky, right into jumping jacks. That's it. <laughs> didn't expect that. Starting to heat it up a little bit, right? <laughs> like, I didn't see jumping jacks coming. <laughs> Touch the fingertips at the top, slap the thighs lightly at the bottom. Keep the shoulders pulled down the back. Now, when you're doing your jumping jacks, I want you to pay attention to the toes and the knees. Make sure they stay in alignment. You don't want the knees buckling in, right? Everything stays in alignment. Toes stay pointing forward. Now we're going to take this right into crossover jacks. Follow me in three, two, one. Take it out, left over right, right over left. Arms parallel to the floor, still opening it up. Do not let those arms <laughs> lift or lower a centimeter. I want you to imagine that I'm standing in front of you with two giant buzz saws, right? <laughs> Do not let those arms drop. Keep them parallel. Now we're gonna build in a little lateral mobility. In three, two, one. Hop it right and left, right and left. Keep the chest lifted, shoulders down the back. You're like, what the hell? This is the warm up. <laughs> Lift that That's chest. What I was just gonna say. A little more speed. Knees up to hip height. Gonna take this right into butt kicks. In three, two, one. Hips forward, chest up, shoulders down the back. Heart rate's up. Get those heels Sore. up to the booty. You're at home, take the, take the back of your hands, put them at the top of your butt. Oh yeah. I want you to feel the heels <laughs> kicking the fingertips. Once you get that, take the arms back to center. We're gonna transition right into high knees in three, two, one. Fingertips forward, draw the knees to the elbows. This is it. It's the home stretch. Oh boy. We're five, <laughs> four, three, two, Woo. one. Done. Ah. Beautiful. Nice okay, and warm. Over. <laughs> Blood's flowing. Now here's the beautiful thing. If you're at home and you're like, ah, I don't have time. Blah, 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 blah. I don't have time. Call it a day. Just do the warm up and move on with your life. But if you have a little bit more time, we're gonna dive right into the workout. Just gonna take a little bit of time. Let the heart rate come down. Yeah. Got the blood flowing. Just have a tiny little glisten going. <laughs> Maybe you're sweating like a pudding at a picnic at home. If that's the case, that's cool. You start where you are and you build from there. So just gonna let the heart rate come down and then we're gonna get right into these six moves. This is very, very simple, the format. We're gonna do these six moves back to back for 12 reps each. After we finish the sixth move, we're gonna take a little rest, and then we're gonna follow that format two more times for three total rounds. Ready to get it? Ready to get it? Come on, come on, get excited. Let's do this. Get excited. Okay, okay. Very important, you know this, you know this. You need to know this at home. 
it starts in your mind. All of this work, it all begins in your mind. You have to see it very, very clearly. Once you see it in your mind, it can move into your body. And when it starts to feel impossible, that's when you really need to start talking to yourself. Yeah, right? yeah find that push. Find <laughs> whatever it is that's gonna motivate you through to do the work that you need to do. Start talking to yourself. If you feel like you're gonna die in the middle of the workout, <laughs> just keep repeating to yourself, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, right? And you will. Nice deep breath. Let it come down. First move that we're gonna do, call it a drop squat. So, John and E is going to do modifications for all the moves. So if you can't hang with Anna and I, just follow her, nice and easy. But I want you to push yourself. Know that place where you feel like you can't really go any further and then start to drive it forward little by little. All right, enough talking, let's get after it. Feet together. Arms up overhead, draw the shoulders down the back. From here, you're gonna hop your feet out to shoulder width apart, touch down behind the heels. I want you to get as low as you can without losing the curve in your lower spine. So the weight is in the heels, chest is lifted, shoulders are down the back. From here, you're gonna explode up, squeezing the inner thigh for one, two, three, four, five. Keep the chest Ooh. lifted, shoulders down the back. Seven, eight, nine, knees and toes stay in alignment. 11, last one, 12, beautiful. Ooh. When you're coming up, I really want you to squeeze that inner thigh. It's gonna make all the difference. Feel it, right? Yeah, it I feels did. good. Second move, head tappers. It's a push-up variation. You're gonna come down, top of a push-up position, wrist directly under the shoulders, chest open, shoulders down the back. Modifying, drop to the knees, but very, very, very important. Cross at the heels, pull the heels up to the booty so that you're not on that kneecap. From here, lower the chest all the way to the floor, push up, tap behind the head with the right fingers for one. Repeat on the left, two, three, four. Woo! That's it, come on, you got this. Five, six, really draw that elbow in line with the back of the head. Eight. Nine, come on, we're more than halfway there. Who can there. do push-ups as fast Ten. as Adam? <laughs> Not Anna. 11, 12, come on, I'm waiting for you. Uh, I'm waiting for I you at home. 11? We're right here with you, whatever speed you're moving at. 12. I want you to be proud of that. Pink. Beautiful, <laughs> excellent. You're going for 12, you work at your own pace and rhythm. We're just here to help motivate you. Third move, pivot lunge. Come to stand, set those feet nice and wide. Lift through the chest, shoulders down the back. Clasp the hands right in front of the chest. And from here, you're gonna twist it out to the left as you drop it down into a lunge. Explode up to center for one, two, three. Keep that chest nice and proud, nice tall torso. Beautiful, this is six, halfway there. When you come down, make sure that that front knee Stays directly over the ankle. Boom. Eight. Nine. Now, if you need to modify this, just don't go down as low. 10. Two more. Stay with me. 11. I love that stretch, too. Right? To the front quad. Good. Also feels nice in the hip. Yeah. yeah. So that's 12. From here, we're going to go right into what I call a high low. So it's a really great core exercise. Also tortures your arms, your shoulders, your back. I love it. It's always dress season, right? <laughs> right? Exactly. Right? Your workouts do not stop in the summer. <laughs> That's right, I always say, in New York, where I'm from, summer bodies are built in the winter. So start in the top of that push-up position, wrists under the shoulders. From here, you're gonna lower each forearm to the ground, one at a time, and then back up for one. Down, down, up, up for two. Need to modify, drop down to the knees. Three. I want you to be very careful to keep the wrists and the elbows directly below the shoulders, right? Don't let them come out too far. Puts too much pressure in the shoulder joint. We're halfway there. It doesn't matter which forearm goes down first. Nope, doesn't matter at all. Just as long as you're going one at a time and keep that booty out of the air. <laughs> and when it gets hard, that butt sticks up nice mm -hmm. and high. Get it down. <laughs> no cheating your reps. Two more reps left, come on. Feeling the abs burning. That's it, beautiful, I love it. Who's starting to sweat? Me. Me. Last one, excellent. Sit back on the heels, 
shake out your arms. Starting to realize I probably should have worn a hat <laughs> or get a haircut. Come on, shake it out. That's From here, we're, back to the pink. we're going we're gonna progressively burn those arms and shoulders, but we're gonna add in a core move. So from here, come down into that low plank position. Load those elbows directly under the shoulders. Reach out through the heels, through the crown of the head. Once you have that perfect low plank position, you're gonna pike the hips, drive the right knee to the face, reset, repeat on the left. That's one. Two, get that hip oh, baby. all the way in the air, and then reset it down to neutral. Three. This is no Great. joke on those low abs. Oh no. Yeah. This is how you work both those upper and lower abs at the same Woo! time. Feeling oh my God. You feeling it? Oh, yeah. yeah. You also feel no, it in your calves. Listen, when I ask you what muscles I want your, you're working, I want your answer to be Everything. all of them. <laughs> That's it, come on. More than halfway there, that's seven. Come on, stay strong. What did I say? When it starts to feel really difficult, push. I want you to push yourself. Start talking to yourself. Talking. We're at 10 reps, wherever you're at at home. Be proud of that, keep working. You can do this. this is 12 for me. Me too. Ah. Oh, How you feeling? Woo. Feeling good? Fired up. Yeah. That's it, beautiful. Fired up. Nice right. and warm. So now wow. we have one more move in this round. Gonna come to stand. The feet are hip-width apart, chest is open, shoulders are down the back. Now, we're huffing and puffing. I hope you're huffing and puffing at home. But here's where we're gonna crank up the heat a little bit higher. This is a little high-intensity finisher. I call it knees and toes. So you're gonna run out knee, knee, tap toe, toe. You go as fast as you can. That's how you make it more difficult. Boy. Going for 12 reps, right? So knee, knee, toe, toe, that's one rep. Let's get it in three. Two, one, hit it. Knee, knee, toe, toe. Keep that chest nice and proud. I'm getting confused. I'm on my <laughs> totally, right? Come on, coordination. I want you working the most important muscle in your body right now, your brain. <laughs> come on, we're halfway there. At least I'm halfway there, come on. <laughs> Let's make this competitive. Let's go, Anna, come on. Come on, John Denis. Let's go. What do you have at home? Four more. <laughs> Two more. Last one, and rest. Oh my goodness. Ooh. That's one round. Yeah. Now you're familiar with all these moves. Okay. Take a breath, let the heart rate come down. Look at you sweating. Awesome. It's a beautiful thing. You're glowing, I great. love it. I want you to look at yourself in the mirror right now, and I want you to say, sweat is sexy. Own it. It sure is. So we're gonna let those heart rates come down a little bit. Grab a drink of water, towel yourself off. Now that you're familiar with the moves, you sort of have the mechanics yeah. baked into your body. I wanna increase the intensity just a little bit. Not so much demonstration, not so much talking. We're just gonna go right through them, okay? So I'm gonna grab a little drink of water. And when you drink your water, just sip it. I don't want you chugging it because then it's all sloshing around in your belly, yeah. right? It's Sweat not gonna feel good. And mm -hmm. Wait for after. <laughs> That's it. Beautiful. All right, how are you feeling? Good? You should be shouting at your television or computer right now. I feel amazing, yeah. Ready for round two. Excellent, let's go. Exhale, step those feet together, reach the arms overhead, shoulders down the back. We're gonna get into these drop squats in three, two, one, hit it. One, up, two, up. Keep the weight in the heel, knees and toes in alignment. Four, five, six. Again, this is your modification. It's stepping out. Be sure to really load that weight in the inner thigh. What do you got? 10? <laughs> 12. Beautiful. Take it down. Top of that push up position. Wrist directly under the shoulders. Chest open, shoulders down the back. Lower chest to the floor. Come up. Tap one. Down. Up. Tap two. I want you to move super slow on the way down, and then try to explode on the way up. Five. Up. Seven, come on, we're more than halfway there. Eight. Really pull that shoulder back in space. 10, two more. Up, 11. Up, 12, come on, you got it, and I'm right here with you. Come on, push, push. That's it, come on, last one. Up, yes, gorgeous. Come up to stand. Feet nice and wide, clasp those hands in front of the chest, take it over and down. Up for one. 
up for two. Where are your shoulders? Are they up around your ears? Back. Relax yeah, them back. down the back. Up. Keep that front knee over the ankle. Drop down as low as you can. This is seven. Up, eight. Up, nine. Nice and slow. Up for 10. That's it. Up. Last one. Explode up. Relax the shoulders down the back. Take it right down for high lows. Load those wrists onto the shoulder. High lows are tough. Uh, like I said, this is simple, but it sure as hell isn't easy. Three, two, one. Take it down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. One rep at a time. Nice deep breaths. Don't hold the breath. Keep that booty out of the air. This is five. Come on, almost halfway there. Six, seven. Come on, we're over that fence. That's it. Home stretch here. Eight. Woo, we can do this. Nine, yes you can. There is absolutely nothing you can't do. Woo, only two. Come on, ah. last one. Up, 12, awesome. beautiful. Shake out those arms. Ah, nice deep breath. Ah, you know what's coming. Ah. Plank pikes, baby. Take oh it my down. Gosh. El <laughs> Elbows under the shoulders. Reach out nice and long through those heels. Pike the hips, knee to the face. Do it on the left for one. Two. Can I modify this for just holding a plank? Or you what absolutely can. If you need to modify it, just hold that plank. Try ah. to hold it for 30 seconds. Come on, that's five. Halfway there. Moving in your own pace and rhythm. Come on, if anybody's ever told you, you can't do something in your life, I want you to use that as motivation right now. Ah, that's I so it. can. Come on, prove them wrong right ah. now. This what? is 10. Oh, okay. oh you want ahead of me. Oh, she's beating me. And 12. Okay. Woo. Uh, Feel that burn. I'm counting oh, those dear God. Ones, Adam. That's it. Come I'm on. I'm counting those ones. Beautiful. Out. <laughs> I love it. Sweating. Oh, yeah. Dripping sweating, all over the floor. Feeling like a billion dollars. Come to stand. We're going to burn it out with knees and toes. Okay. 12 reps. Come on. You've got okay, this. Okay. Got it. Inside of you right now Let's do that. is your greatest self dying to get out just to open the door. Three, two, one. Hit it. Knee, <laughs> toe, toe. Keep that chest nice and proud. This is six. Come on, we're on the other side of that fence. Eight, nine, <laughs> 10, 11, 12. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Nice little rest. Need it, need Let it Let the too. heart rate come down. I like the perfect timing. Beautiful. Breathing. The rest comes at the right place. Perfect. And the rest is really important. If you don't rest, you can't go as hard. Getting a fairly mediocre workout. Let that heart rate come down, let your energy systems recharge, and then you can put that pedal through the floor. So you don't need a lot of time to work out. No. Right? You just need to force yourself to go at your own intensity. Beautiful. Yeah. And whatever the maximum capacity of that is. And then Where, some. Wherever you're starting, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but He's it's different for everyone. Comfort zone today. Yeah. Had a girl. So you're out of comfort zone, you're getting better. And it feels good, right? It feels amazing. Here's a beautiful thing about working out like this. When you crush it like this, especially first thing in the morning, it sends your metabolism through the roof. Yep. All day long, slicing and dicing calories. Absolutely. Yeah. Like a ninja. This is how you literally. Morning workout. You literally lose weight in your sleep working out like this. It's a beautiful thing. All right. Oh boy. Enough talk. Come on. Here's a great that. thing. This is the last round. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Let's go, Pete. Totally. I see you at home giving me the oh, finger. Yeah. It's okay. We embrace it. It means Help you're working me. hard. All right, drop squats. Whatever go. you just did those last two rounds, I want you to revolutionize your body. I want you to peel the freaking roof off of your house or apartment. I want you to be working so hard you start to scare the pets in your house. <laughs> Feet together, fingertips overhead. Come on, let it out right Woo. now. Your best self in three. Do it. Two, two, one, one. hit it. Up, two, going at your own pace, your own rhythm, you're going for 12. Come on, it's only 12 reps, push hard. Seven, I'm more than halfway there. Nine, 10, two more, come on, push, push. 11, get down low, 12. Take it right down, head tappers, wrists under the shoulders, chest to the floor, up, tap, down, 
tap. Really draw that elbow back in line with the back of the head. It's gonna really define the back of the shoulder. Even out those muscle imbalances. That's beautiful. Woo! This is six for me. Seven, eight, more than halfway there. Come on, be motivated, nah. beta bio. That's it, come on. I always get to 10, and I'm like, 12. shaky. <laughs> come on, shaky Jake. One more Work shaky, it. shaky. That's Woo. it. Yes, beautiful. Ah. Guys look amazing, oh. you're crushing it at home. From here, everybody up. Pivot lunges, nice wide stance. Clasp those hands, take it down and over. Explode up for one, two, three, four, five. Halfway there, beautiful. Take it down slow. Explode up, eight, up, nine. Keep the weight in the heel, 10. 11, last one. Super slow. Explode. 12. Shake out those arms. My arms are really burning coming. on those. Oh, Come on. We know what's coming. I know, right? I'm feeling it oh, everywhere. Beautiful. It's a good indication you've been working those arms this entire time. Okay. Take it down. High lows okay. with some of the shoulders. Here we go. And go. Up, up for one. Keep that core tight. Nice deep breaths. Stare at the ground in front of you. Keep that neck and spine in alignment. You know this move now. Don't look at us, look at the floor. You're in competition right now with exactly one person, yourself. Yeah, that's it. That's it, come on. More than halfway there, this is eight. Wherever you would hard art home, be proud of it, and finish it out. 11, down, down, up, up, 12. You still working at home? because I'm still holding for oh, you boy. right here. Come on, you can do this. Push, push. You know there are people at home right now who aren't done with this. Come on, we're right here with you. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You're almost there. Yes, beautiful. Last one. Plank pikes. You know you love them. You know you love them. Love them. You'll be loving them when you're done. Okay. Come down. Low plank position. Elbows directly under the shoulders. Reach out through the heels and hit it. Knee, reset, knee, reset. Nice deep breaths. Take those hips all the way down to neutral. When this gets hard, that booty lingers in the air. Come on, it's those few inches, those tiny little centimeters that make all the difference. Come on, this is six. Oh no, I was on eight. <laughs> Nine, 10, two more. Out of the comfort Eleven. zone, out of the comfort zone. 12. And knees down. Oh. Guess what? Got some good news for you. It's the last time you're gonna have to do plank pikes today. Oh yeah. Oh, Hello. That's really good. I think Gorgeous. it's all that praying. Yeah. It's really that good news. Had our hands Beautiful thing. Like this uh, yeah, praying. exactly. Praying that it's over soon. Okay. Good news. It actually is over soon. Ooh. Let's take it okay. up. Okay. All right. I want you to take a nice deep breath because I want you to hit these knees and toes super hard. Crank that thermometer up until your knees quake, your heart pumps battery acid, okay. and your body goes to the next level. Guys, the next Three, level. Three, two, Come on. one, hit, hit it. it. Come on, keep that chest nice and proud. This is five for me. More than halfway there. Stay with it, stay with it, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ah. Come on, come on, 10, 11. 12, one more for good luck. Ah, 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 done. I gotta get come over. That is awesome. it. Thank you. Oh, it's killer. Five. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. My girl, these girls okay. are no joke. Okay. These it's women are legit. Uh, nice deep breath. Let the heart rate come down. Now I want you to take just one second and reflect on the work you just did. Be proud of that. It's not easy. Let that swagger stay with you through the rest of the day. When difficulty comes your way, I want you to think about what you just did this morning. Yeah. Like, crush ah, it. This is nothing. Crush it. It's like, do you see my knees and toes? <laughs> Beautiful, all right. Amazing. So from here, just gonna let that heart rate come down a little bit more and we're gonna stretch it out. Nice, static stretching. Really lengthen out those muscles. So come to stand, feet hip width apart. Soften the knees. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, dive down through the center of the chest. Fingertips to the floor, step back deeply with that left foot. Nice deep lunge. 
Take the hands to the inside of that right foot, lift the chest, draw the shoulders down the back. Feels good, right? Just let that hip drop into the floor. And really push up through the back of that knee. Try to get that leg straight. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, take the right fingertips to the outside of the right foot. Fingers in line with the toes. Step the back foot forward till it's about a foot behind the back heel. Come up to a totally flat back. Reach out through the tailbone, through the crown of the head. Inhale deeply here. Exhale, take the chest to the knee. Nice deep breath. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. My legs are shaking. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Exhale, chest to knee. Soften that front knee. Step forward with the back foot to meet the front. Step back deeply with the right. Hands on the inside of that left foot. Inhale, lift through the chest. Exhale, draw the shoulders down the back. I like you so much more in this state. <laughs> <laughs> You're like someone get him a pillow. Here we could be friends. There we're kind of enemies. <laughs> I love it. I'm sweating like a maniac right now. Me too. Push through that heel. Lift through the chest. Shoulders down the back. Take the left fingertips to the outside of that left foot. Fingers in line with the toes. Step forward. That back foot. About a foot behind that heel. Inhale up to a flat back. Exhale, chest and knee. Beautiful. Almost there. Really feel that in the back of that hamstring. Oh, I love it. Feels good, stretch. right? Yeah. So good. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, chest to knee. Soften that front foot, uh, front knee rather. Step forward with the back foot to meet the front. Take a nice wide step out to the left. Straddle those legs. Beautiful. Turn the toes out. Heel toe the feet till they're about just outside of shoulder width apart. Inhale, left forearm up to the left thigh. Right forearm up to the right thigh. Exhale, relax the shoulders down the back. Lift the chest, shoulders down the back. And then use those forearms to just press those thighs apart. Right, feels good. Lift through the chest. Make sure that the knees and toes are in alignment. Really, really important. Again, lift. Exhale, left fingertips to the floor, right fingertips to the floor. Press into the heels to straighten out those legs. Heel toe the feet together and just hang over here for a moment at the hips. Take a hold of opposite elbows. Nice deep breath. Exhale, flutter your lips so you sound like a horse. <laughs> Do it again. Inhale. Exhale. Helps get rid of all that tension in the jaw. Let go of the elbows. Soften the knees. Press into the heels to roll up very slowly. One vertebrae at a time like you're giving yourself a massage up the back of a tree. Roll up to stand. Shake it out. Flutter those lips, that's what I mean by flutter your lips. Take the feet hip width apart, soften the knees. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, draw the palms to the center of the chest, soften the knees. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, take it down one last time. Inhale, sweep it up. Exhale, draw the palms right into the center of the chest and close your eyes. Really, seriously, do it. Close your eyes. I just want you to take a couple nice deep breaths here with your eyes closed, feeling a sense of gratitude for all that hard work you just did and all the hard work you do every day. Exhale it all out and have a beautiful day. Woo! We'll catch you guys next time. Awesome work. I survived. Work. Yes, you did. Uh, you, you didn't just survive. Every minute of it. You crushed I it. <laughs>Thank you so much, Adam, for bringing this workout to Pop Sugar fans. That was killer. Thank you for having me. And remember, so important, you do not have to live a boring, restrictive life for it to be a healthy, happy one. Awesome. And remember, check out for all things Adam, adamrosante.com. And be sure to comment below and share this workout with one of your friends. Thanks for watching Pop Sugar Fitness.